control stinks. There was a little billy goat who found a mobile phone, just like the one the farmer lost and kept it for his own. He hid it from his mum and dad. He knew that they would what they would say. Then you're not old enough for that and take the phone away. Off he trotted down the lane and to show his best friend Cyril. They played a funny game and took a photo of a squirrel. They found a tatty scarecrow and they wore his coat and scarf. Then Cyril took a selfie and that made the two goats laugh. They listened to some music and then filmed a crazy cow. Hilarious, said Cyril. Billy, that shall, what shall we do now? B little Billy thought and said, let's make a funny call. He scrolled to the farmer's contacts while they hid behind a wall. Billy called his brother and he burped a little tune. Then Cyril rang his sister, whooping like a big baboon. They scrolled through all the names, then Billy's eyes lit up with glee. I've got the troll's number here, he said. Oh, what a laugh. Yippee! Grandpa Gruff says trolls are bad. If one should ever meet us, then we cross the old stone bridge, he told me. It would eat us. Let's send a message, Billy said. We'll sort out troll from here for thinking that it owns that bridge and filling goats with fear. What shall we say, asked Cyril. Little Bill began to text. Get off the bridge, you stink, he typed, and Cyril, your turn next. Cyril took the mobile and he texted. Troll is dumb, your dad has got a warty nose. A moose looks like your mum. The goats grew even bolder, as Bill said with a laugh. I bet Troll's got an ugly mug. Let's take his photograph. We'll post it on the internet. The foulest face you'll see. That will make the troll think twice before it bullies me. They trotted past the meadow and across the spooky wood and found the reeking riverbank where the stone bridge stood. I've set the phone to camera, said Bill, Billy with a grin. When Troll pokes out its ugly head, we'll both burst in. Then you can take its picture. You must do it in a flash. And then, gasped Cyril, Billy giggled. Off we dash. They waited for the moment when they entered bold and brave. But to their horror, a big bad troll was not inside the cave. Just a tiny frightened troll who looked as sweet as pie, with tears rolling down her face. What had made her cry? Someone sent me horrid text. We wept upon her bed. What wicked monster would do that? Um, us, the bad goat said. Why do you hate me so, she sobbed. I've never once hurt you. Not every troll eats goats, you know. We trolls have feelings too. I'm truly sorry, Cyril said. Then Bill said, so am I. We're really silly billy goats. Forgive us, please don't cry. The goat kids hung their heads in shame. They put the phone away and played a game called Making Friends, which everyone should play.